Okay, in this video, we're gonna cover the importance of Kazushi and how to train our students and how to train ourselves to have better Kazushi. So this is something that we spend a lot of time with our high level athletes, um, drilling. And this could be a warm up session. It could be after practice when they're tired. Um, as you know, the most important part of every judo throw is the ability to off balance your opponent and to move his body weight in the direction of the throw. Okay, so basic Kazushi is pulling him to you, right? Pulling your opponent to you on every throw. We want to make sure his upper body come to, comes towards you, right? So what we do to train this is we actually do repetition over and over again down the entire mat. And as we do this, we want to engage our entire body. Okay, we're not just doing, this is not just an arm movement. This is a movement where you're generating power from your legs, you're using your hips, using your entire body to move your opponent. Okay, so I'm gonna have Tyler hold lapel sleeve, I'm gonna hold lapel sleeve, he's gonna stand in a square stance, okay? Now, I'm gonna take a step back and I'm gonna use my legs and my body, I'm gonna pull him as high as I can towards me explosively with both of my hands. As I step back, pull, step back, pull. Now, every time I do this motion, I wanna make sure my pinky hand rolls up, my elbow goes high. My, if I'm holding the lapel with my other hand, I wanna make sure that this hand is also bringing his body towards me. My thumb stays above my wrist, stays above my elbow, and I'm pulling his body towards me with the lapel hand. So the sleeve hand should rotate high, and the lapel hand should also pull him to you. This. And notice every time there's a big step backwards, okay, so I take a big step backwards, pull. Big step back, pull. I always want to put my body in the stance that I'm going to fight from. So I'm a left-sided judo player, so I stand with my left foot forward. So all of my pulling when I'm training, this is the stance that I want to be pulling from. Pinky goes high, lapel comes forward. Change the stance, pinky goes high, boom. And now to get some power going, I want to explode and pull him to me. All right, so it's going to look more like this. We would normally do something like this about for five minutes straight, where I would just move all the way down the mat, do probably 10, 15 pulls to get to the end. Tyler would do it on the way back. Then I would do it, he would do it, and we'd put the clock on, and all we would focus on is just moving our opponent's body for five minutes in as explosive a way as possible. And you do that, you develop some good strength and power from your legs, your hands, and your kazushi comes out much better. 